What is up guys, Gabsido here, and today, I'm just kidding, that's that's not my intro, uh, if, but if you can guess who uh, who had that intro, you're gonna be winning uh, a Lamborghini, I promise, but let's get into the news, so if you read the title, uh, you would know that League of Legends has a big problem, in my opinion, and I've been wanting to make a video on this for a long time because I think this is a big issue. And recently I saw an interview with Reginald, uh, owner of TSM, and in that interview he complained about the exact same things that I was thinking about. So I thought this was the best time to make the video. So, the biggest problem with League of Legends is... Drum roll! <laughs> Patches! Riot Games has a need to constantly patch things, and it sounds so silly to complain about it because we're so used to it. I mean, nerfing and buffing champions and items here and there, reworking champions like the latest Yorick rework for example, uh, changing the meta every month and stuff like that is a big problem for the game. It's a very difficult subject because at the same time as League of Legends is a competitive sport, it's also a casual game for many players and they need to make the game feel fresh for a mainstream audience of players and viewers of the LCS. So they start making changes to the game to make it more enjoyable, to make it more fun. But that can hurt the competitive scene, or the people who just take rank seriously. This is exactly what Reginald was complaining about in an interview with Skara. What do you think about these crazy patches that come in? I know Riot does like mid-season and pre-season are supposedly supposed to be the big patches. Like, What's your personal opinion on these types of last minute changes? Well, I mean, if you look at it from a fan perspective, right, they have a lot of fun uh, watch, watching LCS and Worlds with new champions. And, uh, you know, it, it, it just gets all crazy. You see a bunch of new champions. You see Darius and GP running around, like, just killing everyone. But, like, from an owner perspective and a player perspective, it's honestly really discouraging. At some point, if League of Legends wants to be taken seriously as a sport, in my opinion, they need to stop releasing patches. I mean, it's simple as that. Like, for other reasons than to fix bugs, they need to stop releasing patches. I mean, I think it's enough that they release a new champion every once in a while, because it shouldn't feel like a new game when you come back after a short break. Like, you you go away from playing League of Legends for like one week, you come back and it's a completely fucking new experience. It's like, I don't even know what I'm playing anymore. You got like a, a new map, like five reworks, Syndra is a fucking AD carry. I, it's, that wouldn't even surprise me, like that, that's, uh, I, I call that, I fucking call that, that, that's gonna happen next patch. It's so annoying that you have to read a long list of changes every few weeks to make sure that your favorite champion is even playable anymore. I mean, it shouldn't be like that. There has to be other ways to keep the game fresh. I mean, just keep it outside the main competitive 5v5 summoner shrift balanced gameplay for serious players. Like, one example of that is the game modes that, you know, the rotating game modes that let players just mess around for fun. For fun, 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 fun! There are many variations of, like, football. I, I don't know any English names for it, because I live in Sweden and I only eat meatballs with my fellow Vikings every day. But you can play many variations of football with, you know, friends and just mess around. Imagine if they changed the main rules of the sport suddenly. Like... <laughs> Since it's only one week left until the Football World Championship, we decided to make the goals two meters wider just to spice things up a bit, because that's fun for the viewers, am I right? <laughs> no. No. It, it, it's not. No. Just no. And that's like literally what just happened with League of Legends. Like, I would be so frustrated if I was a pro. I mean, I, I'm frustrated enough and I'm, f I'm, I'm fucking platinum. Like, holy shit. Since League of Legends is a computer game and doesn't have a referee or rules in the same way that other sports do, the numbers are the rules and constantly changing with nerfs and buffs and champions is like changing the rules every few weeks. And with reworks, I mean don't even get me started, like I'd rather have an old champion get outdated and become completely useless and unplayable than for it to get reworked so we have to deal with this shit again. <laughs> So, to sum things up a bit, uh, having to constantly patch a game isn't something to be proud of. It just shows that the game has problems. So I don't understand why they're so happy to release these updates. When you make big changes, then that opens up for new problems that need to be fixed with new patches. Then that patch fixing the previous patch needs the patch to fix even newer problems. 
Then the patch fixing the patch's patch needs a patch to... P p what? So I think that wraps it up for this video. Uh, if you have any opinions on this, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section below. I read all the comments and uh, if you could leave a like on the video, that would be really good. Like, I appreciate that so much. Like, every single like makes my dick go really hard. Uh, so if you want to give me a huge boner, please tap that like button right now. And uh, if you want to make me even happier, you could go ahead and subscribe. Also, uh, YouTube is pretty weird at the moment when it comes to notifying subscribers about new videos. So if you could go ahead, if you're already subscribed to the channel, if you could go ahead and click this button right next to the subscribe button, and then you click this button right here, and it's going to make sure that you're notified whenever I upload a video. That would help me out so much. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a good day and peace!